My name is Cindy Poulin, and uh, this is Woody Hill Gardens. So here's the front part of the garden. Now, there was nothing here when we bought the house 38 years ago. And then as you go around the house, my mom used to live in this whole apartment down here. And this was how this all got started. And the gardens actually started in this corner where my mom's section was. And this was her back step. So this was the first garden that was created. So this is where she spent a lot of her time and she did a lot of work on the front wall here. And these are all lilac bushes. There was three lilac bushes here on the other side of the house. They were next to the clothesline just to prevent the wind from whipping the clothes off the clothesline. And from that, we got this whole wall of lilacs. This is a honeysuckle. So if you smell it and it smells sweet and we put it right by her bedroom window so that it would smell when she went into the bedroom. Now, this was her other little section of garden. Then you kind of come around here and this kind of dictated how big the pool could be because we had all this kind of shape out. So we, this is how big we can have a pool, that's it. <laughs> so this is a climbing hydrangea. And this is what, if you know about the secret garden, this is what the secret garden is made out of. You see where the arbor was and you can see where the arbor, this plant has actually kind of like taken it apart and now it's holding itself up. And this little garden over here is kind of like a shade garden. This is mock orange, and what happened during an ice storm is it kind of fell. And I said, oh, should I cut them down? And then I just said, you know what, we'll just cut them back and see what happens. And it kind of created this little garden in here. That's my dad's old wheelbarrow with his old skinny thing that he would flatten all the uh, concrete out with. And then this turns into this other little garden, goes into another room. I just started working on this one, so this one needs some mulch and stuff, but and then this is just a little garden in here and it was where I thought kind of set up a rain barrel that takes all the water off the top of the house and I can put these hoses on and I can kind of disperse it throughout the garden and then this is pretty much it except for the kind of well back here it's nice because you get a nice breeze all the time this is kind of the greenhouse area it's kind of more industrial <laughs> I try and keep it so that I have this fence and this will all grow up and hide all of my pots and stuff that I take care of everything with. And this is the greenhouse. Um, not, that, not much left in here now, just um, I gotta empty it. It's gonna get too warm here pretty quick. It's already 80, 90 degrees in your fan bedroom, so. And then we've created a little patio off of the greenhouse where we just kinda sit and watch over the garden and the vegetable garden. So, yeah, kind of nice. And we have all that nice land of marks to look out over the trees at night. So it's kind of pretty. But that's it. Pretty much the whole garden.